Although the playmates are already far behind the leaders, actor Hayden Christensen's team is moving at a snail's pace and has slipped to last place. Hayden is making his first foray into expedition racing. Competing with his brother and sister, Hayden is getting his first taste of the perils of the jungle. I, mean, I was making a movie prior to this race, and really only finished it a week and a half before I got here. Nature in the raw, in the way it's met head on in an eco challenge, is one of the greatest levelers. Some people could be a homemaker, a school teacher, CEO, a movie star. But when the gun goes off and you're in the outdoors, it's an equal opportunity destroyer. The jungles, the rivers, the mountains, they don't care who you are. Let him walk up his oh, window. Oh, Hayden, put another one on you. Oh, my God. I can't <laughs> take all these ticks. Oh, my God. Is it a tick? Is that what it is? It sure looks like one. They're big, too. So the first, this one was just on your pants, but the other one was crawling up your back? I don't know. You've got another one on you. <laughs> That's okay. You guys, we're in the jungle. It's their home. <laughs> no, there's no leeches. <laughs> I got my brother and sister looking after me, so I felt like I was in good hands. If I was going to do something that was this tough and that, that was going to put me in such extreme situations, I mean, who else would I want to have there with me? Of course I'd want to do it with them. <laughs> I just have a lot of respect for, for my brother and sister, and I admire them and, and, and kind of want to follow in their footsteps in a lot of ways and what they're doing. That's more or less why I'm here. Well, we took a little detour, didn't pick the best route, and tried to scale probably the biggest cliff around. I, I fell 15 feet onto my back from some cliff. For some, I thought I had he was going to die. I thought he was dead. I, I thought he I was dead. He was there, and then he was gone. He just got happened to scratches. land on his life jacket. Lucky 13. We were laughing through it, but sort of crying and laughing at the same time. But now we know where we are, we know where we're going, everything's set, and we're back on track.